Good morning. Now time for your weekly Kasuth Regional Health Center report. I'm Mike Vandy. I'm joined this time around with Deb Hansen. Deb, for those that may not know, uh, we've had you on the program before, but for those that may not know, what is your role at the Kasuth Regional Health Center? I am a registered nurse here at the hospital, and I work on third floor, and so that all includes ER, OB, and med surge. Now, we're talking with you on the program this uh, morning because we're talking about the DAISY Award. What exactly is the DAISY Award? Ready. So, the DAISY Foundation was started by the family of Patrick Barnes, who passed away. He died from a disease um, that affected the, his immune system, and that's where the acronym DAISY came from. But he had had such wonderful care, not just for him, but also for his family while he was hospitalized from all of the nurses, and they wanted to do something to honor them. So they came up with this DAISY Award, which is in every state in the United States plus numerous countries worldwide. Now, you mentioned there uh, what the award is and really how it began as well. Uh, when did the KRHC begin celebrating nurses with the DAISY Award? We started this several years ago. Mason City does this every month because, of course, they have a lot more nurses than we do. So we started it, do it, doing it on a yearly basis several years ago. Now, if one's looking to nominate uh, a nurse, you know, a talented or special nurse for this award, how can they do so? So we have forms at the hospital that you can fill out and send in. You can get on our website. There are several different criteria that we like you to keep in mind when you are making a nomination, such as makes a special connection with patients and families, works well with the health care team to meet patient and family needs, makes patients and families feel comfortable, provides excellent education to patients and families, includes patients and families in the planning of care, and goes above and beyond what is expected. Now, a final couple of questions here, kind of a joint question. Uh, what is the deadline uh, for this award? We'd like to have all of our nominations by April 10th. And then the uh, second part of that question, uh, when is the winner going to be announced? So the winner is announced every year at during hospital week, which is celebrated in May, and we have a omelet breakfast one day, it's usually Wednesday, um, and the nominations are read, and then the winner is announced on that day. Perfect. Well, Deb, thank you so much for joining us here on the uh, program this morning. And, uh, again, I'm sure we'll speak down the road, but, again, thank you and have a good rest of your week. Thank you so much. This has been your weekly Kasuth Regional Health Center report. You can hear a new report every Thursday in the 9 o'clock hour, about 9.05, and you hear the repeat every Tuesday, same time frame, about 9.05, right here on Hometown Radio, KLGA.